Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you're looking to make your TradingView experience a whole lot smoother, today's video is just what you need. We're going to walk through how you can import and export your watch lists directly on TradingView. By the end of the video, you'll know exactly how to bring in your favorite stock list from other places or back up the watch list you've worked so hard to build. Let's jump right in and make your workflow seamless. All right, let's start from the top. First, head over to TradingView on your browser. It might sound obvious, but make sure you're logged into your account. This way, all the changes you make today will be saved properly. TradingView is packed with features, so sometimes it's easy to get lost in the interface, but don't worry, I'll guide you through each click. Once you're on the main page, look up towards the top of your screen and click on Products. This is where TradingView keeps a lot of its tools, but today we're focusing on the watchlist feature. Just as a quick heads up, your watchlist is basically your personalized dashboard for tracking stocks, crypto, or whatever assets you're interested in. Think of it like your favorites list, customized for your trading needs. On the right-hand side at the top, you'll see the watchlist panel. Go ahead and select it. This is where you'll see all the tickers you've added before and also where the magic of importing and exporting happens. If you've ever wanted to transfer your watchlist from a spreadsheet or maybe share it with a friend, this is the spot. Now say you're looking to import a watchlist, maybe you've got a list stored on your computer or you're switching over from another platform. In the drop-down menu within the watchlist panel, look for the option that says Import. Click it and TradingView will prompt you to upload a file. It's as simple as selecting your file and letting the system do the rest. This step might take a few moments, especially if your file is large, so don't panic if there's a short delay. The watchlist will load up soon enough, and you'll see your tickers appear right away. Importing is super helpful if you've curated a list elsewhere, or even if you're collaborating with other traders who want to share their picks. Now if you'd like to export your current watchlist, maybe you want to create a backup or transfer it to a spreadsheet for analysis, hear how you do it. In the watchlist window, look for the advanced view option, it's right beside the little plus icon at the right. This part is sometimes easy to miss, so if you don't spot it immediately, just take a breath and scan the top corner of your watchlist panel. Once you're in advanced view, you'll notice an upward arrow labeled Export List. Click that arrow, and TradingView will generate a downloadable file of your current watchlist. You can save it wherever you like for future reference. Exporting is a great way to keep your research organized or to share your picks with teammates. And that's all there is to it. Importing and exporting your watchlist on TradingView takes just a few seconds, but it can save you loads of time in the long run and keep your trading routine flexible. Thanks so much for tuning in and following along today. If this tutorial helped you out, please give the video a thumbs up, and if you have any questions about watchlists or TradingView features, drop them in the comments below, I'm always here to help. And don't forget to subscribe for more handy tutorials just like this one. Happy trading and I'll see you in the next video.